welcome back to SRB Gaming. Today, as part of KSP Real Solar System Episode 10, we are launching a small space station to the planet Mars. You will see snippets of the entire mission played in cuts throughout this short video. Anyway, we are launching a three Kerbal station. This station includes structural elements which contain a procedural battery holding plenty of electric charge, a large SAS unit for turning and spinning the ship, three docking nodes for future missions, and six separate solar panels to provide power to the station. This space station will be used for future Mars missions such as orbiters, Phobos landers, Deimos orbiters, and Mars landers, which I will be using in the future. This rocket had to be rather large because the space station was, although it was a very small space station, it was still big enough that I needed a rather large transfer stage. The rocket was rather large again, and not the prettiest rocket, but it worked, and as you saw at the beginning I had a uh, fairings around it because of Ferrum Aerospace Research, FAR mod, needed to have good aerodynamics. The transfer stage was plenty to get to Mars and circular eyes, which was good. Um, although, wouldn't go much farther than that without a bigger rocket. The space station ended up in a near polar orbit, which I suppose is not the best, but it works for what it needs to work for, and uh, I can adjust the inclination as I approach Mars rather easily from far away. At the end, you'll see the Kerbal EVA, and uh, he will check out his ship and I'll have some lights on it. I detached the transfer stage at the end, although I could have kept it. I needed to be able to turn the station in case the ship ran out of fuel and say I had to turn to dock with it, so I am keeping it that way. And uh, yes, very short video, just showing you my station. So uh, thanks for watching. Subscribe, push the button in the top corner at the end of the video. Thanks for watching.